Hello friends, good evening. In this video, we are going to see about greedy and lazy quantifiers. Already in the last video, we have given an introduction about quantifiers. Quantifiers by default, it acts as greedy in nature. Okay, we can make them as lazy by including or attaching the question mark symbol. Okay, in the lazy column, you can see we have attached a question mark with the, all the greedy quantifiers. So before we go to the regular expression tool, what is this asterisk quantifier? It matches 0 and unlimited times. And plus symbol is it matches 1 and unlimited times. And question mark quantifier is it matches 0 and 1 time. Okay. Now I will explain this lazy and greedy nature with in regular expression tool. And also you will see what is backtracking in a regular expression, how the internally regular expression works when we use the greedy and lazy pattern. And go to the regex tool. This is our test string. Okay, now I am going to use the pattern double quotes dot asterisk and double quote so now it is match one match we have identified okay so how it has worked internally it matches the double quotes it is here in the test string it starts here and then you see the here tool tip it matches the previous token as this previous token is dot dot means it matches any character that is it matches unlimited times okay so what actually internally it has happened means it matched till this end okay not here actually it matched till this end but it is not able to identify these double quotes double quotes ending in this pattern so it is backtracking it is backtracking and check whether it is a double quote no it is not then again it is backtracking check whether it is double quote no it is not like this it is backtracking till it comes here that that is till it reaches this double quote it backtracks and finally it found the match and then it is returning it okay this is how internally works now this is greedy in nature this quantifier i want to make this as lazy by attaching this question mark now see the result now actually how it has worked means it has identified this double quote and then dot star that is it matches zero and unlimited times it will match till here after identifies it double quote it will start it will stop returning after that it will not return anything until it finds the same pattern it will not return as match you can see in the right hand side we have only three matches now okay first match is automation first again the regular ex exception engine regular expression engine just it comes to the next line again it has identified double quotes at the beginning and it identifies this pattern and finds the double quotes at the end once it is done it will not return anything until it identifies the same pattern so we have retrieved three matches okay if you use the plus symbol again it will work same manner because just it returns one and unlimited time correct even if you are playing a shame mark with the plus quantifier it, it it works in the same manner the only difference is if you use the star symbol it, even if there is no match actually it will return because inside the double quotes actually there is no character since it matches zero and unlimited times it is also considering as on match but if i use the plus symbol it will not be considered as match because there must be at least one character inside this double quotes that is the difference between this plus and asterisk quantifier now we are going to use this quantifier that is question mark quantifier I am going to use UI path. We'll just use so question mark 
so it is greedy in nature means it will return one time okay that is a maximum time it can uh, match and return so by default it is greedy in nature you can see in the tool tip it is mentioned as greedy now it is greedy in nature if you make them as lazy it will not return the this capital after ui path you can see here we have one match okay if i use another question mark and make them as lazy we have only ui path is matching we, this capital p in the platform is not match okay this is how lazy quantifiers work and also backtracking in regular expression you will see another example now let me pair it off we are doing regular expression quantifiers okay now we will use this pattern that is quantifier plus quantifier so now it has matched everything now i want to know what tag actually now i want to retrieve only the tag if we if it is greedy in nature okay so it matches the character that is previous token is the dot dot means it matches any character first is the lesser than symbol it matched as it is and then it matches the character as many times as possible okay till the end and it is returning one single match if i use this greedy nature as lazy by using this question mark attaching the question mark you can see it is returning the tag only so what has happened now it has matched there that is lesser than symbol and then dot plus it has matched one single character after that immediately it matched this greater than symbol once it is done it will not return until it is same pattern is identified okay so it has come here again it has identified the lesser than symbol and then it has identified this dot plus that is characters it has matched and it uh, finally identified the greater than symbol and it has returned the two matches okay you can see in the right hand side it has returned two matches this is how greedy and lazy quantifiers work if you like this video please subscribe and support our channel now we will see with another topic in the next session thank you friends